I think the reason why I like creating close-up images with a shallow depth of field is because I started macro photography with my phone. And with the little phone lenses, you have no choice but to have a shallow depth of field. Now even though I admire close-up photography that is razor sharp throughout the entire image, I still feel drawn to an image where much of it is out of focus, and a narrow depth of field is used to draw your focus to a specific part of the scene. I rarely have a plan when I go out to take photos, but today I want to practice trying to isolate a small area of interest in a chaotic scene. Today I'm also experimenting with my phone and a macro lens attached. Moment recently added focus peaking to their app, so I'm trying that out. A macro lens attached to a phone typically works best for really small subjects. Here is the difference between the same subject, albeit a little too big for my phone, using a moment macro lens versus my DSLR and a 100mm macro lens. Thanks for watching. In my next video, I'm going to share some video and images taken with my new telephoto lens. 
I have been wanting to try a lens that can get close-up nature shots as well as getting a little closer to birds I come across while on my photo walks.